guys, so it's me again with my grandma and the rest of my family. Um, we are actually walking around Big Lots. So today is going to be a window shopping video for da -da -da -da, Christmas, since Christmas is right around the corner. So they have so many different things. Also, if you hear my child or my siblings, that's just random. So I actually had a tree like this, but I got mine at Walmart for 150 and that was about five or six years ago. So I really like these trees right here. My grandma's four foot nine and so am I. So you can see how tall this is. It's a pretty tall tree. Um, but stuff like for outside, I would recommend this, even though it's $60, it's a pretty penny. That's 60, that's Yeah, but it still looks pretty cool. Um, for all of those glamour glitzy gals or guys, I would suggest this pretty silver one, even though it is $200. Now, I like to decorate the outside of my house. We've always done that since I was a kid. I can always remember my grandpa. And here comes my sister and Abish. Say hi, Abby. Hi. Say hi. Now, my sister is obsessed with Christmas, so me and her Abby. tend to go all Abby's out. And Abby, come here. And Abish loves to go all out as well. So, with the outside Christmas decoration aisle, they have Santa Claus truck with a tree, the bumble from Rudolph and the Red-Nosed Reindeer, a little camper, Santa and his reindeer, and just all sorts of little things. Now me personally, I like to do Christmas lights and I love the just regular plain white lights on a tree with different colored bulbs. So let me go this way so I'm not just randomly um, videotaping people or whatnot. Now, I do love the classic white look, so this would be something that I would go for. And then, it doesn't really snow where I live, but these are beautiful. I would love that. Um, I love silver and blue. Those are normally my two go-to um, Christmas colors. Um, but let's explore some more aisles. Let's see, so these are the Christmas bulbs. I think those are pretty good prices. Now see, since I have a toddler, I tend to get the plastic bulbs. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Little Rudolph, press here, and their nose lights up. That's actually, how much is it? $12 for that, that's not bad. And then they have like the little elf ones and this. They have this for your car. I remember putting one of those on the van that I had. Now into wreaths and garland. Personally, I'm not a big favorite fa uh, person um, of garland. Now, my grandpa used to put them on our tree every single year with tinsel, and I hated it. I've never liked the look of it, but for those of you who do, I give kudos to you. And sorry if I look a mess. I've kind of been having a um, some issues and everything. My depression has kicked back in full force, and sorry about my weird hair. Um, so let's talk stockings and tree skirts. Now, I love the traditional white, so me, I would go with something like this, but if you have animals, I would possibly go with something a little different, um, especially depending on if you have a cat or not. Now, if you have a cat, I would suggest putting a, um, I guess baby gate around the <coughs> bottom of the tree because that worked for my cat and both my daughter. Um, and everything and I love wreaths so something like this is perfect if you have snow in the area that you live at now if you don't I would suggest doing something like this or where I live at in the country which I'm not a big fan of but it is very beautiful out where I live I would suggest something like this because it's got a rustic charm to it I guess and a country feel um, and these are some poinsettias these are fake but fact poinsettias are actually a tropical plant and I can't remember how they correlate with Christmas or whatnot but it just kind of caught on for Christmas um so here are some more cute little decorations um you have like this kind of modern Christmas tree thing it's actually eight dollars so that's a great price um and we always count down to Christmas, specifically my sister. So if you do that with your children, I would suggest something like this. Or you can actually make your own. It's pretty easy. Um, I can't remember if my sister made one or not. But I actually love 
these little Santa elves like this. I think they're completely adorable. Um, and something like these would actually make a great centerpiece for a um, table, a side table, a um, coffee table, anything like that. I love candles. So, and I love spruce. My sister can't have it because of her asthma. Um, but I would suggest something like this. Or you can actually take cinnamon and some vanilla flavoring, put it in a simmering pot with a little bit of water and boil it and it makes your house smell like a Cinnabon restaurant. Like, it smells amazing. It makes me think of fall, Christmas, everything like that. Hello, Russell. It's my brother in the background. Um, then they have doormats, little pillows, everything. So I suggest if you want to get what's worth your money, I would definitely come here. Um, so yeah, that's my video for today and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.